All right, I want to do a quick unboxing here. Um, uh, first, I'd like to say that I didn't even know about this until I watched MN Bassin TV. He posted a video on this, and I'll post a link to his video, and you can check out his channel. Uh, all right, this is a. Uh, the go cheap GoPro mount through Amazon. Um, the actual company is newer pro quality. Amateur prices. It's all just GoPro mounts, and I paid. I wish I had a paper. And I think I paid like, uh, what was that? 30, 30 something, 40 something dollars with shipping or something for this. It's a 50 piece GoPro. all the mounts and stuff. I guess the first thing is going to be the selfie stick. And I've watched other videos on this and it seems like people think it's, uh, everybody seems to be happy with the quality of the stuff. Also, I they say uh, the uh, Geek Pro cameras are good too and they're a lot cheaper than the GoPro. So, I, And I've been thinking about getting a new camera so I think I might be Trying one of the Geek Pro. And this is a selfie stick. That looks good. I don't know how much I'll use it, but it's a nice to have. The biggest thing I wanted was a chest harness. Because I want to do the videos like, uh, uh, one rod does with the chest mount but they're so expensive and it's like well I get a chest mount with this plus a whole bunch of other stuff for less money than what Walmart sells it for so and I got a nice case here Let's see what we got inside wow look at that uh, all kinds of mounts in here He got a big, uh, full-size tripod. I just got a small one in mine, but this is okay. I got a, I use a, uh, on my boat, I have a pedestal mount in the center of the boat that I have a painter's pole down into a, the, one of the seat mounts sticking up, so, and then there's a handlebar mount, I think will work good for that, but. You get this tripod mount. I think I actually have a full-size tripod somewhere, too. But this, you can wrap it around anything. Yeah. I mean, it's... You could probably break it if you wanted to. But if you're gentle with it, I'm sure, fairly gentle, I'm sure it'll be fine. So I have a tripod mount. It's a nice case. And here, this is, I don't know if I'll ever use this, even though I'm out on the water all the time. I guess it floats, comes with like a lanyard to put around your wrist. Oh, these are these are the things you put in the case to uh, keep it to keep the moisture out. 
got a whole bunch of these. I think it said he came with 12 of them. There's a bunch in each one. What else we got here? Sticky mounts. Clamp on. I think there's a, I think there's quite a few of these in it. There's a tripod mount. So that will screw that right on there. Screw it down and tighten that up. You can put your camera right in there. Just a little pull string bag. I guess you can put the camera in that to protect it. I could try it by using this camera, my GoPro, to film this. But more sticky mounts, and these are the. Sticky part to put on. Mm. A Velcro band. I'm not sure how you use that. Oh, this thing's pretty cool too. This is... this is like just like an extender. Oh, where's my knife? Snap together good. So yeah, I think I think if you go on Amazon and you want if you want to do a GoPro, go on Amazon. There's a lot of like aftermarket stuff and cameras and stuff. You can get it a lot cheaper. I think GoPro you're play if you're paying for a, paying for a name, you know. This is a mount to strap to a bicycle helmet. I won't do that, but I mean, you could strap that to anything really and have a mount anywhere you know, when you wanted to use it. I think this is a, like a, it's all that. Another strap to it. Like a lanyard strap. I think this is like a tightening tool. Yeah, if you wanted to really tighten down on something to get it tight, the clamps. If you have a hard time gripping them with your fingers. More of these. Is 
these are uh, some garbage here. I think this is like a lanyard if you don't you can stick it something to something so you can't to keep you from losing it if you're afraid of losing it somewhere. more of these clear I mean you could have these things stuck all over everything you own probably this thing I like I'm gonna say here it's a pretty stiff spring in that this is so you could you can clamp it like if you have a backpack on or anything with a strap or you could clamp it to uh, your visor and your visor in your car. Or... Like if you went and bought all this stuff from GoPro, it would cost you a fortune. This will be good because I use my GoPro in, the, in my pickup sometimes. Oh yeah, this thing here too, because I got my, this I wanted, clamp that right to my, uh, this is like your bicycle handlebar mount. Comes with more, more of these extenders. We'll, Twisters, extenders, whatever you want. This does. Uh, this is going to go on my paint pole on my middle of my bolt. This I'll use this a lot. This is probably the head strap. Goes over your head and your hat if you want to do a hat cam mount. Oh, this is good too. I could use this in my pickup too if I wanted. Suction cup mount. I wouldn't use this. The experience I've had with these, I would use this inside the truck, but I wouldn't. I wouldn't put this outside because sometimes these things tend to let go. Then my experience anyway. And the quality is decent, I mean, you want to treat it with a little care, but if you don't overly tighten everything, because some of the screws are plastic. But if you're careful with it, I think you'll be fine with it. Do what you want to do. No problem. And then this is the harness. This is what I was thinking about spending forty dollars just for this, and I got all this, so I can have a chesty mount. Hopefully, it hopefully it'll fit around my fat body. Yep, yep definitely a good deal. And there's the case. I'll definitely use this too. Looks like you take these foam pieces out and you can, it opens up little pockets to keep stuff. Very good. They definitely worth the money. Can't go wrong with this. So, all right. Thanks for watching. We'll see you later.